Ooh, of the smoke. Dominate choke. Ice, ice. My bro. What's good, my nieces and nephews of homie? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Uncle is back again with another video today. Look, 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 look. A different type of build video. Different type of build video today. Today, we have our we have taken our talent to NBA GK24 current gen. <laughs> Alright, this is gonna be my first ever current gen video, you feel me? Cause I've been seeing a lot of my dogs and I've been seeing a lot of the current gens having passion in the comp stage. Like the comp stage on 2K24 is dead. I can't lie. The only thing going for there over there is 1v1 me wagers. But there's too many zeners that's getting away on, on, on next gen and all that. Wagers have been popping on current gen. So I'm like, bro, I'm about to make me a comp stage current gen bar build. Like that's what I decided to do. Now, I have made me my comp stage current bar, gen, uh, bar build and I'm about to reveal it to y'all right now. This is the best NBA 2K24 comp. <clears throat> comp guard build for the comp stage on NBA 2K24. All right, make sure y'all like the video, leave a comment, leave a comment, leave a comment, if you like, mama subscribe if you're new. I don't want to hold y'all's time up any much more longer. Let's get into how to make the new best guard build on NBA 2K24 for comp stage. All right, yeah, we are in the builder right now. We're in the builder. You want to go create a new build? Create a new build. Like I know I don't got my uncle look on this this account yet. I'm I I just haven't switched. I'm still getting my build grinded out and all that maxed out. So I don't have, I haven't switched my face scan. I'm just worried about, you know, getting every single badge I, I need. You want to go position, point guard, left hand, jersey number. I always go jersey number two. Y'all know that because God is first, everything else is second in my life. So we put that jersey number two on our back. And then in the college, you can just put, I'm just, whatever, whatever it said right there. All right. Um, for the, the weight, I mean the height, you want to go 6'1", 100, the lowest weight, 6'1", lowest weight. And then for the wingspan, hold on, let me double check on the wingspan. The wingspan, you want to go to 6'1 wingspan, 6'1 wingspan, and then a slight build. I feel like for comp stage guards, it, you look ugly when you go freaking burly. Don't go freaking burly on a comp stage guard, all right? <clears throat> now, for the build, for the build now, this is what you want to do. For the finishing, go straight, go 51 close shot. Close shot's not going to matter. It just, we need it just because our ball handle takes it up driving layup 76 overall driving layup driving layup's not really gonna matter for you at all anyways as well because comp stage all you really want to do or regular stage all you're gonna really want to do is dunk the ball or dunk the ball and shoot threes that's all you're really going to be doing dunking the ball and shooting threes okay so for driving dunk you want to go with an 86 overall driving dunk i mean it, this year driving dunk and limitless takeoff is not as needed as much as last year but I'm like, bro, I'd rather have driving dunk, better dunk, uh, and get better dunk animations than raise up my acceleration, which acceleration doesn't really do anything for you. 2K Labs tests it almost every year, and acceleration doesn't really do anything for you. So go with an 86 overall driving dunk. This is current gen, so standing dunk does not matter. You know what I'm saying? If it was next gen, it would matter. It does not matter because this is uh, uh, um, um, NBA 2K20 uh, for current gen, not uh, next gen. All right, let me actually switch screens. Now, for your three-point shot, you want to go with a 92 overall three-point shot to get the best base in the game, which is Stephen Curry base. For my 6'4 uh, and under guards, you want to go with the 92 overall three-point shot. 77 mid-range, you're not going to really need mid-range. You can still shoot mid-range with a 77 mid-range, but 92 three. You're either going to be three hunting or you're going to go run and dunk the ball. That's simple. It's just like 2K23 last year. You feel me? This game is like 2K23 next gen last year from last year or current gen from last year just the updated version all right for ball handle we want a 96 overall ball handle to get all the best dribble animations in the game all you need is an 86 overall speed to get all the dri best dribble animations in the game as well and then for pass accuracy we want with a 75 overall pass accuracy to get that needle thread on silver we can throw dot okay we can throw dots um our speed we want with an 81 overall speed speed's not really gonna matter to you as you're going to be playing with a lockdown in center. Like, even if you play park, you can use this for park. Play with a lockdown, a traditional lockdown, and a traditional center, okay? Play with those two type of builds. Play with a lockdown or in a center that's a pop, okay? <clears throat> uh, for acceleration, you want to go with an 80 overall acceleration. 80 overall acceleration. Like I said, acceleration doesn't really matter, but it's nice to have a little bit of acceleration on your build. 
And then you want to go with a 70 overall vert. And then you're this, you gotta even take down this is supposed to be 51. And 98 overall stamina. You really could go 95 overall stamina, because stamina is not like too important this year. Stamina's like, mm, you know what I'm saying? Like it, as a guard this year, you on current gen at least, you really don't need that much stamina. Even on next gen, stamina doesn't play really a big part. Cause I have builds with 93 overall stam and it seems the same. All you need is that three Gatorade. If you buy three Gatorade, you're gonna be good. Cause you lose stamina pretty fast, regardless of what it is. So for your stamina, just go 98 overall stamina. All right. Now we're gonna go back over this. So we get the limitless takeoff. Y'all can see here we get limitless takeoff on goal. It's gonna help us our uh drive and dunk the ball better. Posterizer on silver <clears throat> as well. We go over our, our shooting badges. We get all the best shooting badges in the game. And all you need is agent threes on gold, blinders gold, those type of badges on gold. You don't really need them any higher. They're kind of useless any higher than that. Still even get MIDI magician on gold, so you can shoot those uh MIDI fades or MIDI shots fairly easy 96 ball handle gets you ankle breaker hall of fame you can uh stun your defender hyper drive quick first step unpluggable all on hall of fame land breaker all on hall of fame these these are key badges to you you need to be the best dribble on the court you are the floor general and you get all the best dribble animations in the game i mean i may say why not 92 speed with ball for some of the speed with uh some of the um what's it called some of the uh dribble and uh dribble styles you get but the other dribble styles, the dribble styles you get with 92 speed with ball are terrible. You really don't need that at all. <clears throat> the, the dribble style you want to use is Michael Jordan. The dribble style you want to use is Michael Jordan. You're going to be completely fine. All right. And all you need is the 86 overall speed with ball with that. You're not going to need no defense and rebounding as you are going to be just really guarding the corner. You're not going to be guarding anything else. You're just going to be guarding the corner, man. And you don't need perm D. I mean, uh, you don't need that much perm D to do that. And then for your speed and physicals. Speed, you get 81 speed, acceleration 80, and then strength 41, uh, vertical 70, and then a 98 overall stamina. Okay, that's all you really need for this build. And then I guess you could just put throw the rest on. You could throw the rest on your strength or your free throw if you want to plan to play pro on this game. Anything like that, you could throw the rest on your <clears throat> free throw right there. All right, for the takeovers, honestly, you could go limitless, limitless range takeover. And then you could do um, finishing moves right here. You could do this, but honestly, I'm I'm just gonna double it up. Like you can eventually change it once you get Mamba mentality. So I'm just gonna double it up with uh, double limitless range, to be honest. All right, this is the bill right here, and we get the bill name. You get shades of Demi Lillard. Muhammad Abdul and Tyrese Mask team. We get floor spacing slash floor, floor spacing slash. Okay. Now let's get into the best badges to use for this build right now. <clears throat> All right. For the badges, um, I would probably use, um, I forgot it's this system again. <laughs> Gotta use 10 first before you could even get into the, the, the bottom badges, which is ass. That's why I like next gen. Cause you don't have to do the, like pick the 10 system. You don't have to get 10 of them first and then. So I'd go pro touch, um, pro touch. Wow, you see these is ass. This this system right here is ass. This is what I hated about this game, right here. And then limitless takeoff. But this is what I'd probably do, uh, because limitless takeoff is better than all these badges. I'd probably uh, because I get four extra badges because I've hit level forty in uh the past four seasons or five seasons. I think I get five extra badges. I'd probably throw them, most of them on my finishing and then shooting just so I can get probably one more on my finishing just so I can get a uh, limitless takeoff posterizer on this game is pretty ass. So I'll probably throw it all on limitless takeoff right here. And then for my shooting, I'll probably I'll probably throw three extra badges on two extra, probably one extra on shooting. Oh, shoot. I hate that. I hate doing that in this game. Probably one extra on uh, finishing just so I can get my limitless takeoff and then probably the rest on my shooting. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah probably the rest on my shooting. All right. So for shooting. Probably put on guard up. <clears throat> guard up. Green machine's a nice badge. I'll probably get that on on gold. Um what else? What else? What else we got? We can get our, our low 10. Clutch shooter. And we get into our 10 right here. Um obviously. Uh limitless range. <laughs> obviously limitless range. Yeah, I'll probably throw a lot of my extras on shooting. Cause like 
it's like crazy you don't get like a lot dude i keep doing that hold on i keep doing that <clears throat> i probably wouldn't throw my guard up all the way probably do my guard up like that uh limitless range hold on all right yeah guard up on gold green machine where does that put us green machine here it's just our wait, five, six, seven, eight. Um, we want a little clutch shooter that gets us our 10. Go up on our agent threes, limitless range. That yeah, just cost a lot in the game. I ain't even ah, I need a lot. To and I'll probably throw my extra badges. I'm probably honestly gonna put my extra badges on shooting. I'll probably throw, throw my extra badges on shooting because you it costs a lot. Cost a lot for badges. I mean, for stuff on this game. All right. Um, playmaking. Obviously, you want my ankle breaker. Love ankle breaker. Uh, needle threader. Very big badge. Quick first step. Very big badge. Unpluckable. Very big badge as well. Get our uh handles for days. And they they made this game heavy. I'm not even gonna lie. They made this game heavy. Get a lot of badges. We already got 11 there, so we really don't even need these. I forgot you can even core badges. I forgot you can core badges. There we go like that. And I'd probably core this. Probably core my my ankle my uh what's it called clam breaker. I forgot you could core badges. So let me even go back for this. I'll probably core this. Yeah, I'd core that. That. Yeah. So this makes it actually better. I forgot you could core badges. All right, and then for this, I'll probably core my limitless takeoff. I forgot you can core back. Yeah, I forgot you can core back. Core my limitless takeoff. And slithery is honestly better. It's slithery right there, okay? Or you could even do that. <laughs> I haven't played this game in so long. Um, For defense, all you really need is... Box. I'll probably put box out beast to box out. And then these are the best badges I'll go with. All right, like this. Right here. One sound. He's the finishing, he's the shooting, he's the playmaking, he's the defensive badge. All right, make sure y'all like the video, leave a comment, 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 subscribe if new. If y'all want more current gen or if y'all enjoy the current gen content on this channel, so just leave that like down below, leave that comment, see more current gen content. I got y'all. Appreciate it, love y'all. Just be your boy, everybody's favorite on YouTube, on HK.